Hello, my name is Brian Pace, a table tennis test writer, and this is Tenark. the full potential. Very well. Kennedy 05 FX is best suit. Hey, your touch shots. You're going to have more real estate. Yeah, I talked to his leg, no set. 05 FX. This kind of like screen. Kennedy 05. Catapult. Double Happiness has actually put their hat in the Springs Punch Technology Arena and they came up with Tenarch. This rubber is designed to give you all the benefits of Springs Punch Technology while staying mostly true to the Chinese Top Sheet Protocol. Now that I've given you information off the back of the jacket cover, I'm going to put the rubber on and I'm going to do a test ride and I'm going to give you feedback on the following barometers and they are the head. the loop, over the table play, and the push, and the serve. So let's get started. Since the rubber has dense sponge like Tenergy, I was expecting the ball to explode off. And what came off was a more true representation of my natural power. And with rubbers like Tenergy, we've been conditioned for the rubber to give us so much more. And with Tenarch, it gives you more without taking over your shot. With the forehand loop being the most dominant shot, I really decided to take it through the full range of loops and give you information on what I found. I found that the 10 arc had a much more conservative arc, which opened the door for me to swing freely. The loop from the block has solid contact. And the counter loop from long distance didn't see me struggle at all to find my range. Now, on to over the table play, and this is where it gets tricky um, because now you're dealing with shots like the short push and the flip, and most players choose a rubber based on how well it attacks, and most players get rid of that same rubber if they find that the touch shots like the short push and the flip have failed them, and the 10 arc performed well above my expectations, and I think that's due to the semi-Chinese top sheet. Now, on to the push and the serve. This is what I would consider Springs Punch Technology and what's an added bonus is that semi Chinese top sheet and this rubber isn't as tacky as traditional Chinese sheets of rubber but it still had enough for me to put an ample amount of spin on my return and more importantly ample amount of spin on my serve. If you're looking for a Springs Punch rubber that has good control over the hits give 10 off a try. If you're looking for a rubber that has great arc on the loop, give 10 arc a try. If you're looking for a semi tacky top sheet for controls over the returns and the pushes, give 10 arc a try. And if you're looking for a spring sponge rubber in the $45 range, give 10 arc a spin. And if you're interested in purchasing this rubber, go to www.fastpaddle.com and I'll see you on the table.